हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई रतन अग्रवाल वेलकम यू टू श्री अग्रवाल एकेडमी इन टुडे सेशन व्हाट आर वी गोइंग टू स्टडी वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी समथिंग व्हिच मेनी ऑफ यू नो बट यू डोंट नो द वे वी शुड नो इट व्हाट इज दैट सर सी वी हैव बीन लर्निंग इक्वेशंस फ्रॉम फिफ्थ स्टैंडर्ड और सिक्स्थ स्टैंडर्ड सो व्हाट इज अ इक्वेशन व्हाट आर द डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ इक्वेशन एंड व्हाट इज एन एक्सप्रेशन so let us understand equation so what is a equation what is a equation so if you understand the word equation it comes from the word equal when something is equal to something something is equal to something then it is called a equation now instead of saying something and something we say there is something called left hand side there is something called right hand side and if the left hand side is equal to the right hand side then we say it is an equation for example let us take uh, 3x square plus 5x plus 7 equal to 0 it is a equation or if i write 2x is equal to 8 it is a equation if i am writing 3y is equal to 12 it is a equation if i am writing 2x plus 3y is equal to 15 it is a equation all these are equations well there are some equations like this also c plus o2 gives a co2 so there are some equations we have an equation angle a plus angle b plus angle c is equal to 180 it is an equation now if you are understanding that in a equation there is a left hand side there is a right hand side there is a left hand side there is a right hand side and necessarily a uh, equal to sign in between what is there on the lhs what is there on the rhs is immaterial it can be zero it can be a number it can be anything all these are equations but now if we want to study something different than equations i will be telling you here itself okay let me tell you here only see these two people are called linear equations this is also a linear equation so what is a linear equation a linear equation is an equation in which the highest power of the variable is 1 so this is a linear equation this is a linear equation but then these two are similar they are linear equations in one variables but here two variables are involved so it is a linear equation in two variables sir what about this equation if you see the highest power is 2 so it is called a quadratic equation this is not a algebraic equation it is a chemical equation this is a geometric equation because we are using chemical molecular formula chemical formula and in chemistry we don't write equal to we say gives c plus o2 gives co2 so this is about a equation we have different types of equation we will study afterwards but if there is no equal to sign see remember one thing in equation there should be a equal to sign it is necessary to have a equal to sign but if there is no equal to sign then what it is it is called a expression it is called a expression for example okay what is an expression when something is told and it is understood in the same meaning it is called an expression for example if i am writing like this i think you understood that i am saying carbon dioxide but if i write like this Mm. 
you understood that I am saying the addition of three angles of triangle ABC or if I am writing like this, wow, or if I say alas, all these are expressions, all these are expressions or if I am writing, all these are expressions. There are some expressions which are like this also. There are some expressions which are like this also. This is a happy face. This is a sad face. They are called emojis. Many a times on mobiles, we use emojis like this, like this, like this. What do they say? When you are talking like this, non-verbally, you communicate some things. They are all expressions. If I say like this, means I am telling you that I am going to beat you. If I say like this, without telling anything, I am telling you to keep quiet. They are all emotions. They are all expressions. This is a chemical expression. This is a geometrical expression. These are all verbal expressions. This is an algebraic expression. This is an algebraic expression. This is a geometric expression. This is a chemical expression. So, these are expressions. We will stick to algebraic expressions. If I write like this, 4x raised to 3 plus 7x square minus 9x plus 8. This is an expression because it has only one side. It has no other side. Hence, it is an expression. It is not an equation. And you know, such expressions are called polynomials, monomial, binomial, trinomial, polynomial. Now, there is one more thing which we should know. Now, here there was only one side. Here there were two sides and an equal to sign. But suppose there are two sides and there is no equal to sign. For example, 3x and 8, two sides. One is LHS, one is RHS and they are not equal. It is like this, 3x greater than 8 or 2y less than 5. What are they called? Now see here there is a LHS, there is a RHS, but there is no equal to sign. My dear friends, they are not equations, they are not expressions. They are inequalities. What are they called? Inequalities. So, in this session, we learned that there are three types of things we have to understand equations, inequalities, expressions. Sometimes there is a combination of these two things also, like they may write 3x greater than or equal to 8. Now, here 3x is greater than 8 or 3x is also equal to 8. So, this is a combination of an equation and an inequality. So, this is how we will be learning in further classes in more videos about equations, how to solve them, expressions, how to find their values, zeros of polynomials, blah, 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 blah. I am uploading all these videos on my YouTube channel called Sri Agrawal Academy. There's a good playlist. You can browse through it and find out whatever you want. A lot of concepts I'm trying to explain. I'm trying to give you the best possible things and all this is free. I'm also available on Facebook and Instagram. Do follow me. Make match your best friend. Be smart. Thank you.